proper timing of the level wind mechanism is essential for the successful operation of the water reel. A machine that is not in time will result in miswrapped tube. Timing is the coordination between the level wind fork and the rotation of the spool or drum, which allows for the tight and neat coiling of your irrigation tube. In the event your tube has become loose or twisted, it may be necessary to check the timing of your machine. Sometimes, all that is necessary to correct loose tube on the spool is to pull your gun cart out to where there are only a few coils of tube left on the spool and verify that the remaining coils on your drum are tight. Remaining coils of tube on the drum loose prior to operation can make your machine appear to be out of time. In the event your machine is out of time, this chapter will explain the procedure for retiming your machine. If this is the first run of the water reel, you must verify timing. On the first run of the water reel, you need to pull the tube out 100% to verify that your machine is in time. This is the only time you pull the tube out 100%. Once the tube is pulled out all the way, verify that the inlet elbow is at a 45 degree angle behind the axle center line at the bottom of the spool. Be especially careful not to pull the tube off the elbow. Remove the four bolts that hold the level wind fork in place and remove the fork. Observe the position of the level wind carrier drive lug master link on the horizontal level wind chain. This is the chain that runs left to right behind the compensation bar. The drive lug must be in the three o'clock position, halfway around the sprocket and on the same side of the water reel's drive system when the tube is pulled completely out. If the drive lug is in the correct position, your machine is in time. If it is not, timing will need to be adjusted. Remove the level wind guard. Remove the two bolts on the level wind input sprocket. Now you can manually adjust the level wind mechanism to put the machine back in time. Timing is adjusted by grabbing the gearbox shaft with your channel locks, holding the sprocket still, and making adjustments until you see the drive lug at the three o'clock position. Once the drive lug is in the correct position, line the bolt holes back up on your sprocket and replace the two bolts. Once the bolts have been tightened, replace the level wind fork with the four bolts and then replace the guard. Your machine is now in time. To keep the water reel operating efficiently, it is important to lubricate it in the designated locations after no more than 100 operating hours. The following diagrams will show you the points on your water reel that you need to lubricate. These diagrams can also be found in your printed manual. Use a water resistant grease for lubrication. Both stabilizer legs. The drum supports on each side of the water reel and the jack. The hose guide mechanism, fork support, primary chain, bevel gear pair, and secondary chain. Last, the turntable bearing. The gearbox in your water reel arrives pre-filled with SAE90 oil. There is a sight gauge on the gearbox to assist you. The gearbox must be kept full of SAE90 oil. At the end of the irrigation season, there are several simple steps you must perform to winterize your water reel before storing. 
Be certain that the water inlet to the water reel is open and that the water supply hose is removed. Lower the sprinkler cart from its transport position. Once lowered, open the drain valve on the sprinkler cart body. You do not need to pull the tube out all the way for winterization. You only need to pull one or two coils of tube off the spool to expel some of the water from the spool's axle and the sprinkler cart fittings. Rewind the coils of tube using the hand crank. Make sure all openings, such as the water inlet, are plugged so rodents and insects cannot bring foreign materials into your water reel. For engine drive machines, be sure to service the engine according to its manual in preparation for the next season. These simple steps will ensure the longevity and proper operation of your water reel year after year.